Hello, I'm Shannon from Waffle Flower, and I'm here at scrapbook.com to show you how to create a colorful coffee time stamp set using the paper piecing technique. The card we're creating today is going to be an A10 size, which is nine and a quarter by seven and three fourths unfolded. So I'm going to cut my paper to those dimensions to start. I've trimmed my paper down to nine and a quarter by seven and three fourths. I'll now score at three and seven eighths. And now we've created our A10 card. We're gonna paper piece this coffee cup together. So the first step is stamping the coffee cup five times onto this white cardstock because we're gonna create five coffee cups. I'm gonna ink it up in a black ink. And I'll die cut these coffee cups out with the matching die. So I went ahead and die cut all five of the coffee cups out. Now I have to stamp my coffee cup five times on craft paper and then five times on these colored cardstocks. For the craft paper, I only want this wrapper around the coffee cup to be in the craft. So that's the only portion that I need to get on this craft paper. Now that I have the coffee cup stamped five times on the craft paper, I'm going to stamp it once on each one of these colored card stocks. With my coffee cups all stamped, I'm now going to fussy cut them out. On this craft paper, I'm just going to fussy cut out the wrapper part. The trick here is to cut right along the edge of the wrapper, even cut into the black just a little bit. This will make your paper piecing be more seamless. So now I have the five coffee cozies all cut out, and now we're gonna move on to the colored cardstock and cut out the cups. Again, I'm gonna cut right along that black line. I'm gonna cut around the cozy too, but you could just cut that part off. And I'll repeat this process for the other four coffee cups. Now we're ready to put our coffee cups together. We're gonna to start with our white coffee cup, grab one of the color cardstock, add some glue to the back, and then match it right up with the stamped image on the white coffee cup. And then we'll add our little craft cozy. And there's our completed cup. Now I'll repeat this process for the other four coffee cups. Now my rainbow of coffee cups is done. Now all I have to do is stamp my sentiment. I've got my sentiment from the Coffee Time stamp set mounted onto an acrylic block. I'm going to heat emboss it, so I'm going to add some anti-static powder down first. Ink my sentiment up with Versamark ink. And then stamp it on the cardstock. Now just pour on the white embossing powder. Now heat set and trim with the paper trimmer. I've trimmed down my sentiment and now I'm going to add some foam tape to the back. Cut some strips here and I'm just gonna add it right behind. And I'll also add some foam tape behind my coffee cups. I've already added it to these four and I'll just add it to this last one. Now I'll remove the backing and begin to stick down these coffee cups. Just remove the backing on the sentiment and stick it down. And that will complete the paper piecing rainbow coffee cup card. Thanks for watching. If you like this video and want to see more from scrapbook.com, please like, share, subscribe, and leave a message.